Hello friends, I am Apurva Vashish, Assistant Professor of Biani Group of College. Welcomes you all on behalf of the Guru KPO. I am going to deliver the lecture on the pulley which is from the subject mechanics. Pulley. Pulley is actually a type of lifting machine. In my last lecture, I have already told you about the lifting machine and I have made you understand about its different terms used in it. Pulley is actually termed as a single unit but to uh, uh, but to increase its mechanical advantage, the system of pulley is being used. Uh, in order to work with the pulley, we have to make certain assumptions. These are the uh, the load, which is the load of the pulley, is taken as negligible with respect to the weight of the load, which has been uh, uh, which has been added towards it. Then the friction of the rope, uh, which is uh, the friction of the rope with respect to the pulley is also being taken as negligible. So therefore, the tension all over the rope is the same throughout the system. And this tension, if, because it is the same, therefore, the mechanical advantage will be equal to the velocity ratio. And that is uh, the mechanical advantage as it is equal to velocity ratio. This will be equal to 1 as the efficiency. Now, let us consider the system of the pulley. The system of the pulley is of three types. First, the first order system. Second, uh, second order system. And the third is the third order system. Uh, let us now consider the first order system of pulley. This is the first order system of pulley. The two pulleys are being attached. One pulley is attached to the, uh, to the ceiling, which is fixed. And the other pulley A is a movable pulley, where the load is being attached. The effort is applied onto the B and this, uh, the ending of the rope is attached to the ceiling and the one end is having the effort, uh, the effort is applied to the other end. As we know that in the idle condition, the friction is uh, zero and the load, the tension all over the uh, rope uh, to, uh, throughout the pulley is same. The weight is applied at the pulley A and the tension towards the rope is distributed the same that is W by 2 to all the respective ropes. The effort when it is applied uh, towards this, the effort will be equalized to W by 2 that is given by. Thus the movable pulley, the uh, weight is attached and the weight and the load will be equals to W by 2. The load is given by W. Thus, the weight is been, uh, been uh, reduced to the W by 2. Thus, due to this, the mechanical advantage and the velocity ratio will get equalized and that will come as 2. Thus, the first order system, it says that if the system of the pulleys, it consists of the two pulleys, then the load, uh, the tension in the, load, in the rope is being... Uh, is being divided the same all through the road, rope and that will be divided by 2 and the effort which is uh, being applied onto the rope will be equalized to the tension which is on the rope. Next we have this uh, also uh, if there are the two uh, pulleys being attached over here but if we have the other pulleys attached due to this the uh, tension is divided simultaneously. If there are three pulleys then the tension will be divided as W by 8 and if they are 4 then the tension is divided similarly. Thus the velocity ratio or the mechanical advantage can be denoted as 2 to the power of n and the n, n denotes as the number of movable pulleys number of movable pulleys attached to it. This is about the first system of the pulley. For other system, you may please log on to www.gurukpo.com. Thank you. Thank you very much.